I think the, um, the, the lesson for a lot of, of the things we are showing is just there are multiple ways to do things. There are hard ways and there are easy ways. And if you know all the tips and tricks, it will be easier for you. Before we start, you, we start on my side. Um, let's... Um, Okay, we'll we move on to the one with the colors and we are watching any for uh, a minute. Time is about creativity and it's also three letters we have to find. And also Daniel does not listen to me when I say we start on my sign. Just start the game <laughs> and whenever you are done, um, we will see. So there are three letters hidden in this. And this one is, I hope it's a little bit more tricky than the first one. So there are different levels of difficulty. Some are really easy. Um, Daniel gave, gave a session today earlier where he showed one or two tricks which would help him to solve um, these um, rooms we're going through. So I hope he remembers his own hacks he shared with the audience. Okay, and let's just switch and see what Daniel is doing. Daniel is lost so far. D okay. Ah, uh, uh, so, sorry. Yeah, that's not my thing. First thinking and then trying to solve the problem. I just <laughs> start, but it's a great, great advice, Daniel. So, sorry for interrupting your thinking process. Let's just see what we got on any side. Anybody found any letter yet? Otherwise, we, when we have a minute left, I will just give you a hint to um, get you on the right path. So I did drop a little clue on there. The art is on the walls. We assure you. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Let's see how Daniel is doing. Oh, Daniel found an A. That's great. We can see it um, under the light blue or greenish brush. He found an A. Yeah, no, uh, I think. So, and he found the second letter, which is a T. How is Annie doing? Um, try to use the yellow brush on the red paint. See what happens, Annie. A little bit up, a little bit up, a little bit up. Oh, there it is. Okay. Well done. If you, it's a, if under you pressure, could, it's hard to get these things. Yeah, you know? a lot of thank, eyes on you. Thanks a lot for for accepting this challenge. You knew it would be tricky, and it would be in front of a live audience. Yeah, this is how we try to solve problems. Um, I can. We, we have uh, at least a minute left, right? Yes. Okay. Then, if I I know. Uh, you are very ambitious, but I can show you on Dan. Oh, Daniel got the last letter. Great. Um, I will just uh, give you a quick run through that Daniel has the, um, the solution. Here, I just take your brush. Sorry for um, destroying your, your artwork. I take one of the brush brushes and then you see, oh, we have your letter that's hidden. And I can only see it if I put the brush over it, or in this case, under it and then go through the rest where it doesn't work. And here it doesn't work also, and like this. And then I have the uh, spray can. And if I go here, I can see the R. But if I go here, I cannot see the previous letter. And if I go here, I can also not see the previous letter. So each of these brushes all only reveals one of the letters. It's like this and like this, if you can see it on my screen. And the whole trick behind it is, um, layering and it's a lot of layering and it, it can be complicated but once it's done um, the effects are really really cool and you can hide stuff 
on your board and create something that's not even a game. You can create something that's useful or whatever you can come up with. Uh, so I will give Daniel his solution back. And the last one would be just for any, the last one would be this one. There it is. Great. Um, should we move on? But I cannot see a door. Where is it? We cannot move. Lucy, we forgot the door. Oh my God. And there it is. And I, I forgot. There it is. We created a slide and a letter for you. So please climb up or slide down, depending on which floor you are, to the next room and wait for my instructions. This is especially for Daniel. Wait for my instructions until you. Uh, before you